All right, adventurers. <laughs> okay, so I kind of fixed the problem. I've kind of figured it out. Uh, it's it's a glitch within the entire game. So at any time that I pull up a map within a dungeon, the game could freeze. So what we're gonna have to do is use save states, and it's okay. I'm I'm only gonna use save states whenever I feel like I need to look at the map. It's not it's not a it's not a habitual thing. Okay, so I got back to this room. What I was saying is, uh, this is a special kind of room. If you're paying attention uh, when you're fighting the enemies in this room, you'll notice that they fell down what should be a hole, but it's not that they died. They, they fell to the floor below us. They fell to the floor below us. So if I were to go down these stairs here, we would see that this is the room immediately below uh, uh, the room above. I can prove that to you. I can prove that to you. Let's go back upstairs, and what I'll do is I'll drop down here. So I didn't get hurt, I instead fell down here, which is okay, which is okay. It's actually one of the coolest things I've ever seen a, a 2D video game do. They, they illustrate that this is in fact uh, a, a, a 3D world, it's pretty cool. Okay, so pressing forward, uh, just so you know, I caught back up. I didn't cheat in any way, shape or form. You can see that by me having only half the health I'm supposed to have. <laughs> If they fell down here, they'll fall down too. I don't think it shows them down in the floor below, but this is it symbolizes them falling. Maybe they die. Maybe they die. Oh boy, this is gonna be a fun room. This is not gonna be a fun room. Okay, let's see. I need to get my shield. Let's see, that thing is spinning very quickly, so I need to be careful that I don't fall for its scheme. Oh, too late. And then those things are also moving relative to how I'm moving. This is just, this is just the funnest room ever. I don't know if they told you about this room, but it's fun. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna die. Let's see if I can get over. Where'd they go? Did I push them out the room? <laughs> I pushed them out the room, so so I'm not even gonna be able to get the treasure that's here. Because clearly there's a treasure here. Clearly this is a treasure room. What I'm gonna do is let him come to me. I'm gonna let him come to me. And I'll give him the finest of business. Him and his little friends. Mm -hmm. Now where are they going now? Are they gone? Oh no, okay. They're not gone. Okay, let's see. We gotta we gotta actually do this. I wonder if I can rang them. Can I catch them with the rang? Oh, I'm gonna die for real. I'm gonna die in this room. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to come all the way back here. By hand. Okay, let's let's try some else. Let's try some else. Let's use some bombs. <laughs> yeah, got me manipulative. Is there one still alive? Oh, that didn't count. I'm gonna have to heal. I'm gonna have to heal. I'm gonna have to heal. That's what it is. I'm gonna have to find a way to heal, and I'm gonna die. Brb, gonna go die. Dang, I tried to hit him into the. Into the explosion. There we go. Nope. No! I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. Okay, I'm gonna have to do it by hand. I'm probably gonna find a way to heal. I'm probably gonna find a way to heal. Alright, give me a give me a quick cut. Okay. Okay, we've made it back. We made it back almost full health. Trust me, these boys, these boys cheating. Okay, so what I've learned on the way here, there was a room that had, what, two of these guys in a stairway as well as uh, one of the skulls. If I hit them with my boomerang, they actually will not move. They'll be stunned for a while. They won't, they won't move uh, while I move. So it makes it a little bit easier for me to go to work. Also, I could have just came to the middle of this room. <laughs> and there we go. We got Rock's Feather. You feel light as a feather. If I if I am to assume what I know about other other feathers within video games, specifically Nintendo video games, then that means Rock's Feather lets me do one thing. Let's me fly. No, I won't fly. I will I will be able to make my way over there. I was actually wondering how I was going to get uh 
get cool guy kangaroo in here. I'm not. And I think I need to fall down this way. Yeah, because there's a there's a wall here. Yeah. Okay. So the feather lets me jump over gaps that are uh one pixel wide, one pixel high, however. Which is cool because we can then take that on these 2D areas and make our way here. I'm sorry, I shouldn't say 2D, our, our side view areas. The whole game is 2D, chill. Get it together. Get it together. There we go. Oh, they're just not gonna stop. Oh, okay. That's cool. It isn't, but you know. All right, so I can't make that jump up there, but I can jump across here and go up here, and I can, I can Zelda my way through. Okay, now I'd ask, where are we? I'd ask where are we, but you know, <laughs> the whole map situation. I guess, I guess what we could do is we can, I can, I can go ahead and show you what I'm doing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save it just because I'm gonna look at the map and it might glitch out. I have no idea where I am right now. I have no idea where I am right now. Okay, let's take a look at the map. Okay, so that's where we are now. We're on the bottom floor. Let me go up. That's above us. Okay, cool. It didn't glitch out. Wonderful. Uh, let's talk to the statue. Dear Owl, I need your assistance. Would you please be so kind? Jumping up and on will send you even higher. Is that what this is? This is a trampoline? Am I supposed to jump on it? Hey, it's a trampoline. Yeah, we got the compass. All right, uh, so it looks like, okay, so we're supposed to be able to use uh, what we learned in our previous room about falling down below to understand that we can jump up through as well. So we could jump up through that part there. So maybe we need to move that trampoline. Let's move that trampoline. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready to play? Move that trampoline. This is one of the only Zelda games with a trampoline, isn't it? There, I can't think of another one that like uses this as a mechanic. You jumping up. There's plenty where you fall through floors and you don't die or you don't get hurt, uh, but you actually come out another floor. But I can't think of one where you jump up through the floor. Oh no, this is gonna combine. This is gonna combine the uh, the the power bracelet with this, isn't it? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay, so where I need to go up. There we go. And I need to go down. Look at Zelda, not wasting any time and teaching me how to do stuff the hard way. I need to come up this way. That's the easy way to do this one. There we go. Oh, shoot. Maybe there was something down below for me. Can I go back? Yeah! Oh, wait. Oh, okay, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, there was nothing down here for me. It's just another way out. Okay, I guess the way out. Fine, I'm fine. I'm fine. It'll be alright. Be okay, ladies and gentlemen. I, your boy, chill the beast. We'll be okay. Down the stairs. It's a trampoline. All right, so we just gotta guess and check. That's kind of dangerous. Sounds like I'm gonna hurt myself. Ah, let's. There we go. Ah, uh, okay, so what if we go back upstairs and we see? Okay. Uh, so on the screen right now is nowhere. On the screen right now, there's nowhere I could put the trampoline below and come out. So maybe I need to push it one off screen. One off screen. So it'd be on the other side of, it'd be right here in this, in this square. Okay, let's give that a shot. Let's see. First, we gotta push it all the way. We gotta push it all the way. And we push it down here a little bit. And then we gotta push it all the way. And then we go up two. I hope this works. Nope, not at all. Not at all. Oh, does it go on this? <laughs> Is it supposed to go on this space here? Is that why it's marked? Let's see. Let's find out. I know I know someone's gonna be mad at me. I know someone's gonna be mad at me. 
I can't wait for someone to be like, chill. You know you're pretty smart sometimes. <laughs> you're pretty smart sometimes, but this ain't one of those times, my friend. Well, look at that. <laughs> okay. And then we switch back to the sword and deal with this clown. What is this? It's a key. We got a key. All right, and then down the stairs we go. Oh, all these bats, these keys. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, I have, I have goofed. I have goofed the big goof. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah. Uh, there we go. He dropped down and got his eagle on. Okay. So we do the same here. Yeah. Yeah. Is there anything down there for me? No. Just death. Only death is down there. Yo. I think I know where we are. I think I know where we are. I'm going to take a little bit of precaution before I, before I check it out. All right. Let's see. Yes. We're all the way back at the beginning. This is... This is the platform that I said, oh, so it goes all the way on one side, but not on the other. We're all the way back at the beginning. So clearly that means that there were some things that we should be able to access now that we have the ability to jump the big one. Can I get over here? No, that is a real wall, chill. It is a real wall. Okay. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, right here. I was just going to say, if I'm not mistaken, this room here has a platform floating by the side. Yeah, okay, so now we can explore over this way. Oh, wait. We've been here already. <laughs> okay, so that's just a shortcut. Oh! There's a short stop. Okay. Okay, so let's see. Is there anything up here? Yeah, there was a room to the left that we did nothing in, right? Oh, no. There's nothing for us. There's nothing for us in this location. Oh, what? Uh, um... Oh, he told us about the using the shield here. Guess this is what we gotta do. Let's save. I've made I made a good amount of progress. Having come back here, oops. Okay, that's the wrong button. Having come back here with the with the dungeon's main item means that I made progress. I'm I'm at a point where if I die, I I don't have to redo a million things, and that I am okay with. Let's grab our shield. Let's grab our shield. Raise your swords. There we go. And then deal with this joker. Oop, never mind. He's going to deal with us. Okay. So now let's see. Let's go back to all the rooms and see where we can use our our, our jumping feather. <laughs> see where we can use our jumping feather for good. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. There we go. Actually, there's a chest there. Got to figure out how to get to it. The floor master got me. The floor master got me. I gotta redo this one now. No, I don't. They're dead. Good. They remain dead. Good. All right. It's okay. It's okay. We're we're, we're progressing. We're progressing, and that's all I can ask for. All right, floor masters. Let's deal. Let us deal. We cannot, we cannot just walk past them for they are floor masters. Don't hit me. Don't grab me. Oh, I got an idea. I got an idea, and it does not involve me messing this puzzle up. <laughs> I got an idea on what I can use the feather for. Is it the next room? I think it's the next room over. Yeah. Okay, so this puzzle, I thought I have to be super fast. Because once I hit the switch, the tiles are going to start falling. That's not the case. I don't have to be super fast. I have to be super light. I'm not supposed to touch that, that switch at all. There we go. Yeah. So the key opens this door here. And then how am I? Oh, I guess I want to jump over it, huh? 
I was gonna say, how am I supposed to not trigger this fellow? I I'm gonna trigger. Oh no! Oh no! He got me with the classic joke. Oh Jesus! Here we go. Here we go. All right, so let's talk to this gent. Oh, oh, great owl! What wisdom you have you for us? In water, it is invincible. He talking about the boss. Oh, and that's how I get this thing. That's how I get this thing. It's a Gasha Seed. I'm actually excited for it to be a Gasha Seed. What's invincible in water? How, how, what, what boss? Ooh, excuse me. What boss are we about to fight that's invincible in water? For I have no recollection of any bosses invincible in water. Are they in here? Is that what's about to happen? We're about to get invincible in water in here? Yep. Oh, I get it. Okay, so this boss is invisible in water. I was actually expecting him to jump out. That ain't the case. Okay, so he's invisible in water. Let's get him out the water then. The hell? What you mean? Oh, okay, so we got this. We got this. Let's grab him. Get him out the water. Oh, you can't throw him back in the water, chill. That that defeats the poipus. That defeats the poipus! You ain't getting in the water. Oh, oh, he don't want to get in the water. Come on, come on, come on, chill. Come on, chill. Tighten up, chill. It's just a boss. It's just a mini boss. I was actually expecting the real boss to be invincible in water. I was kind of scared. I was like, how am I? <laughs> how am I, a young individual, supposed to stop a whole boss in the water? Okay, so we're gonna lose our health, but that's okay because we've dealt with. Oh, we haven't dealt with them all the way yet. There we go. Now we're dealing. Now we're dealing with sushi. Oh lord, the sushi's gonna murder me. I'm gonna have to tell my mom that I lost to the sushi. She's gonna be so disappointed. Or she would have. Appreciate you, fairy. All right, so where, oh, there's a stairway down there. Where's this portal take us? Please tell me the entrance. Yes, the entrance! <laughs> All the way back to the entrance, baby. 